Hi, I'm Len Bolver, and I am currently taking Leadership 20 through SunWest DLC Distance. And I am on the Human Behavior Summative Assessment Project, where you have to pick two of the three projects, and I have picked the third one. Uh, in this project, uh, you have to write about a negative attitude you've shown recently, and also a positive one also. So I'll start off with my negative attitude. Uh, the most recent one I've had uh, has gotten me in a little bit of trouble. It's kind of ridiculous. I was watching my favorite basketball team play and they got blown out like like bad. It, it was I wasn't aggressive or mad, I was just depressed. Seeing your favorite team get blown out by more than 40 points will do that to you. Uh, so after the game I was mopey, just didn't answer my mom when she was talking to me, didn't do my homework, and just laid on the couch in despair after that horrific game that totally traumatized me. Eventually my mom snapped out on me and said it was just a game and get over it, yada yada yada. And good thing she said it, because it kind of brought me back to reality and realized that I was freaking out about nothing. The next day I went to school and quick, quickly realized over my pit of dis distress, I didn't finish my homework. I got to my science class and the teacher looked at, looked at it and gave me a 2 out of 10 on it and put it on power school. And of course mom seen it as soon as the teacher posted it, got home freaked out on me because midway through my depression she kept on asking me if I finished my homework and I lazily responded yes every time because I thought that was the easiest way to deal with her. So if I learned one thing from this situation that the Chicago Bulls should never lose, or I should just grow up. Uh, for my positive attitude, um, I usually show my positive attitude during sporting events. Like in volleyball, it's pretty crucial to show a healthy attitude towards your teammates because that reflects on how you play and how others play. Tense games uh, that are wire to wire need healthy attitudes to per uh, persevere. Take for example, in our conferences, we were playing by far the best team we've played all season at our level, and this team was Lalosh. Uh, we won the first set, lost the second, and it came down to the third. Throughout the whole game, we were positive with each other, never got down, and never turned on each other. While the other team were slowly getting mad at each other and yelling, and just were just a negative attitude. Uh, that game, I think I was very positive. I was high-fiving, I was loud, I was very verbal and always had a smile on my face. And pers personally, I think people look up to me to always give the team a morale boost, which I did that day. And of course, the more positive the team won, and we won the conferences that day. Um, if everyone is positive in a team or group, that's what makes them successful. A positive vibe will always uh, make you successful. Uh, thank you for listening. That's all.